All right, we're going to have applicant buses. introductions. Please go to the rear of the planes um, where your introductions will be. Uh, what is your name, miss? Lynn. Your name's Ethan? No, Lynn. Lynn. Okay, Lynn, can you go back to where um, that large gentleman beside you is? Looks like he's on his knees. <laughs> go all the way to the back, please. Please stand up. Okay. No, no, Ethan. I'm sorry, your name, sir? That's Excuse Lynn, and your me. name is Etzel? Can you stand up all the way, please? Excuse me. I had a feeling he was a lot taller. Okay. In any case, welcome to today's set of interviews. Uh, you have both uh, successfully made it to uh, Brower Airlines. It's a new airline that we are pioneering, and we are looking for the best and brightest pilots. I have a phone. Now, uh, if we have your full attention, we're going to be uh, working with you one-on-one, -on -one, asking a few questions, and having you do a flight demonstration for us. Okay. Now, uh, your names, your names are on the right? Ray. Ray, okay. Ray of Sunshine, that's beautiful. Okay, and yours Wait, on the left? Wait, my, no, 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 mine is, is Lynn of Sunshine. Lynn of Sunshine. Lynn of Sunshine and Ray of Sunshine. We'll ask to see which one. Uh, His name is not Sunshine. Ray let's, let's take it easy, please. Say okay. your name. Now, uh, as, we do, as we do interviews, we will actually ask uh, the person who's not being interviewed to actually go into our lobby, which is right through that French door behind you. Yes. And uh, what should we do? Should we have them close the door? No. Or, okay. We're going to just have you leave there. Okay, uh, Lynn believes in closing the door for privacy. No locking needed. No locking needed, please. Okay, I can see this Lynn's going to be a little bit of a troublemaker. Uh, Miss Lynn, could you unlock the door? Could you unlock the door? Okay, leave the door unlocked. We just wanted to get some privacy. All right, Lynn, could you please enter the uh, the yellow plane right here? The school bus plane. Yeah. We haven't added wings to it yet. Um, you're going to be part of our pilot it's program. It's okay. Hey, there, okay. There's fire on the bottom, so we can just... You said there's fire on the bottom? Yes. Yeah. That's for added effect. Even though the... No, no, so we can fly up. Hold on, hold on. Who's giving the interview here? The Browers, yes. So, we wanted you to know what the flames are for. Is since your plane doesn't yet have wings, that's so that you feel like you're flying. Because the flames are supposed to lift you up. Okay. So, have you ever driven a plane, I'm sorry, flown a plane without wings before? Why a plane? You know what, she looks familiar. Did you interview for a school bus driver we had uh, a few weeks ago? Um, yes. You did. Okay. Yeah, but, but this is a different This bus. is different? It's different? different. Uh, again, it's, it's a yeah. plane without wings. We're yeah. going to add wings to it, uh, but not yet. We're actually probably going to have... Uh, the other um, app can help us with that at a later point okay. during the test. But right now, you're in perfect shape. Okay, so uh, my partner here uh, is going to ask you a few questions. So, start us off. Ask a question. How long have you been flying? Um, for like six weeks. Okay, six years. It's a lot longer than a bus driver. been flying for six years? What have you been flying? Um, Oh, international flights, okay. Yes. And sometimes we um, go to Florida. France and Florida, two F, yeah. F uh, countries in the States. Yeah, okay. Uh, all right. That's a good question, okay. Um, why, why are you looking for a job at this time? Are you working anywhere currently? Um, yeah, but I want to have another job. Another job. So, are you looking to get a second job with this pilot? Because yes. we need it as a. Sometimes they take on like one day and do the bus and the other day. Oh, so you're planning on doing the bus? Sometimes the I have a sub if I'm not doing on the bus all the time. You have a sub? Yeah, a sub. Okay. It's like somebody else like that. How many days a week are you available for this job? So. Based on seven days in a week, you said you were going to work part-time with your bus driver job, and oh, I guess part-time with the pilot. So in a week, a week has how many days? Um, one second, let me count. 
Seven, very good. So out of the seven days in a week, how many days are you actually going to be flying for us? We're going to have to see how that's going to work. We probably need you for more than three is the uh, most you can do. Is that the best you can do? Three yeah. days? Yeah, because sometimes I have to get food. I have to get food. I need to get food. you got to eat. Okay. I need it. Okay. So, all right. So, we have Ms. Lynn with us. She will be able to drive. Um, or, I'm sorry, fly two or three days out of the week. Lynn Sunshine. Oh, Lynn, Lynn of Sunshine. Yes, yeah. Lynn of Sunshine. We didn't miss that part. <laughs> Is there anything else we have to ask? Mm -hmm. I feel like we're missing something. Have you ever flown for any company before? Um, yeah. What does yeah mean? Yes. Any, yes. What, what company did you fly for before? Mm -hmm. You don't know? I, I, don't, I don't really know. You'll know the company's name? I just asked them. You'll ask them? You'll get back to us? If they want to go somewhere. Okay. Well, thank you so much for your time, Miss Lynn, of Sunshine. Uh, <laughs> if you would not mind exiting the back of our uh, plane here and go grabbing the next candidate and then waiting outside where he is. Thank you so much. Let me unlock the door. Oh. All right. No need to ah. lock it. Okay. Come on in, Ray. Uh, Miss Lynn, if you could wait outside there, please. No, I'm no, Miss Lynn, Miss Lynn, we need you to wait outside the door the same as uh, Ray did. Please be gentle with her, Ray. It's no. All right, Ray, if you could enter our uh, makeshift uh, plane here. Thank you so much. Hello. Okay, beautiful. Hopefully you will not be disturbed by Miss Lynn. All right, how was, how was, your, uh, how was your wait outside the door? Um, it was... Comfortable. It's a pretty small space. Small so. space? Well, it's just our lobby. We're, we're just going to start out. We're a new airline. I mean, Brown it's, hard, it's hard to dance in there, so. Oh, you're a dancer? Yes. Oh, okay. I was going to ask him. What are your extracurricular activities outside of being a, a pilot? I dance. You dance? Okay. It's now, you're aware that when you are flying in our plane, you don't really not a lot of room for dancing, right? Is that going to be a problem? No. No? Okay. Um, how long have you been flying? Do dreams of flying a plane count? Because of that, so, so I, you've been I've dreaming had, of flying a plane. Yes, I've had hundreds of dreams of flying a plane. You no, know, you look familiar. Did you did you do a school bus application a couple no. weeks ago? No, I swear no. I've seen these these two before. Um, okay. Uh, all right, so you don't actually fly. You've never flown before. In my know? dreams. In your dreams. Okay. I, um, I'm fresh out of question. What do you have for him? Why do you want to fly with us? I wouldn't. I have this top of the line. It's amazing. Flying the sky, going to different places. You know, we can't pay you for the first month. Is that going to be How much is the second month? Half the f what the first month would have been. And then once we get about six months into it, we can start giving you a, a regular, okay, regular so salary. So what will I be staying? Will I be staying in the plane? Well, staying? wait, wait. Uh, to ask a little bit more, I know the previous candidate that came before you had availability for two to three days out of a week. Mm -hmm. What's your availability? I would say... Five out of seven. Five out of seven? Mm -hmm. What if we needed a six day out of you? Can we do that? No. Um, Monday through Friday, that's it. No more. What? Weekends are my off. No questions. So you're not available on weekends? No. 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 Don't even ask. I'm not going to be asleep from Sunday. I'm going to be asleep from Saturday to Sunday. I'm going to be away from Monday. Alright, so. Put these two together, and maybe a pilot for the pilot situation. We might be able to get uh, Ray here on the weekends and get Ray during the week. And go that way. Where will I be staying? Uh, well, that's that's going to be up to you. 
Do I get to choose somebody that you provide me? Since you're not paying me for the first month, that seems to go against the laws of the Well, we have to see how you actually perform. So, put it this way, if you're interested in continuing with the position, so can I be how about we do a field test? Sure. All right. Um, why don't you invite your co-pilot in, Lynn? I think she's ready to go. She looks like she's pretty amped up. You might need to go and open the door for her. She may have some challenges getting in. Oh, there she is. Hi, Lynn. I want to introduce you to uh, your co-pilot here. Um, Hi, my pilot. I'm sorry. Well, she's got seniority over you because she's had six years' experience and you've had zero. So you are going to be the co-pilot to her. Is that a problem? No. Right? Beautiful. All right, can you stand up, please, Miss Lynn? Yeah. Okay, I'm not sure if you've met Ray yet. Say hi, Ray. Hi, Ray. No, his name's Ray, not Ready. Ray. But I think he is ready to go. Now, I'm not sure if we mentioned it before, but our plane here doesn't yet have wings. So we heard that you two down the grapevine were excellent builders. And so what we need you to do before you can even fly is put a pair of wings on well, what looks like a school bus right now. It looks Let's, like a school bus right now. So how long do you guys think you would need to add wings to the plane? Five minutes. I think, I think they can do it in two. Um, I think okay. Uh, no, two minutes. No, uh, no, no. Hey, Google, create a countdown timer for two minutes, please. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's starting now. I'm staring really wrong. Now, don't worry about that uh, That Thomas the Train. I don't think that's going to help you out in flying mode. You can probably move that to the side. You can figure out a way to then the add your wings. I mean, that's Well, this is an interesting looking design you have here. Yes. Where'd, you, where'd you go to school for airplane design? Harvard Law. Harvard Law. That seems like a little bit of a mismatch. A back. Mismatch. They don't have to match. Oh my gosh! Wow, it sounds like there's a phone off the hook somewhere. Sydney, would you have a phone off the hook? You need to turn it off after you make a call. Oh, thank you. Wait, so we're done. Okay. Very good. So that's it? Well, here's a beautiful thing uh, here. Mm -hmm. um, since they built the plane, we don't have to worry about it it's safe or not because it's their liability, not ours. No, but we're your employees. So well, not yet, because we still haven't signed any paperwork. This is why this is part of our test flight. But if the whole pilot thing doesn't work out, if your uh, plane is actually sustainable and stays in the air, problem. then you might actually be able to get the engineer position. We also have the We have problems. I can't really sit in there. That it is hard. I can't put my head up. So, so what you might need to do, remember there's two of you, okay? So, first question, hold on, hold on, Miss Lynn. Hold on, Miss Lynn. So, hey, Google, how much time on the timer? 14 seconds. Are we are we ready for flight? You two? Uh, no. <laughs> yes. We are so ready. Okay, Miss Lynn, why don't you mount up? Lynn, mount up, please. That means you have to climb in your vessel. Hey Google, stop. Are you guys nice and snug in there? No, we're snug. Okay, now I'm not sure what was available when you guys were building. Hold on, I can't hear you, Miss Lynn. It's falling. Okay, well. You guys build it, not me. So you're gonna have to make some fixes as uh, things happen. Okay. Now, uh, I'm not sure what safety regulations there are because again, we're just starting out here. So if there's anything you need inside the bus, you're gonna have to make sure you add that yourself. So I'm just gonna ask just to make sure we understand what's available in there. Uh, so are there any seat belts in your plane? You don't need seat belts, okay. You don't need seat belts for work. Are there seats? Sitting on the floor. Okay. So, uh, do you have parachutes in case there's any emergencies? Yes. There won't be emergencies on this flight. Well, it sounds like Miss Lynn has a parachute, but Ray of Sunshine does not. So we'll get to see how that goes. I'll be okay. Play this. Okay. Are we ready for our flight yet? Yes. No, no. Miss Lynn. I think Miss Lynn's still building. I'm 
She looks like an engineer. I think she's thinking like one. She's looking to balance the wing, which I think is very smart. Definitely don't want the definitely don't want the wing to fall off the plane as it's in mid-flight. Stop, Ethan. Okay. Ready? I mean, wait, wait, wait. Are we ready? Uh, yes, I have a weather name, Ethan. Uh, okay, are we ready? Sure. Yes. Okay, well, we need what both pilots in the plane. Get in here. <laughs> Remember, there's two ways to enter, the side and in the back. Oh, my God. Oh, Oh, That's a very interesting design. I'm not sure if you can see that back there. Oh my God. So it looks as though it looks as though ray of sunshine feet are out the back of the bus. I'm sorry, the plane. Yes. We so, fly. so the pilots are also a part of the flying vessel itself. I wonder if Ethan will put out his arms in case the wing on the top falls off as they're in mid-flight. We'll have to see. Okay. Welcome to Brower Airlines. We're so happy you joined us. Uh, today we have Lynn and we have Ray, and they are going on our very first test flight in what is a modified, hold on, in what is a modified school bus that has a wing. Now, I'm not sure if you've seen the architectural prowess uh, for these two young engineers here, but here they are. Wave in there, you two. Say hi. All right, this is, this is the wing. And if you look all the way in the back, you can see what looks like two feet. Those are actually Ray's feet because Those Ray is a part of the plane. Now, what we've learned is that if the plane does fall apart in mid-flight, the only thing sustaining them in the air will most likely be Ray. So Ray must stay in the airplane if Lynn is to survive, if there are any problems. And Ray will have to stick out his arms uh, in the case that the wing falls off. I have some kids. But with no... Oh, I'm sorry. We actually have passengers. It wouldn't be right if we had a plane ride kids. without passengers. Okay. Well, <laughs> are those are those your your yes. kids, Miss Lynn? Yes. They are beautiful. Yes. Okay. Are we ready? Really are we ready? Yes. Okay. So, what's the first thing we do before we fly? Um, we have to make sure we have to puke. <laughs> Put their seatbelts. Let me get the. Let me put them on the seatbelts. On the seatbelts or in the seatbelts? In the seatbelts. Okay. Sounds good. Okay. They're in the seatbelts. I feel like we need a better seatbelt. Yeah. Mommy is really fun. Oh, I got it. I got it. All right. We're just going to get a better spot here so we can see all the action as it goes. So are we ready, team? Yes, it's Lynn's hair won't stop hitting me. <laughs> okay, now, this is part of the interview, but this is called the test flight. We want to make sure that you guys work well together as a team. What about the kids? Obviously, the kids are in there as passengers, because we want to see how you deal with them as well. Okay. All right. So are we ready to begin this? <laughs> no. Okay, okay. Um, 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 okay, okay. Okay. Are we ready? Yes. All right, so since you two have flown before, we haven't fl flown at all, actually. But from what I heard, Miss, Miss Lynn is the only one with any experience in flying. And uh, Mr. Ray behind her has had a dream of flying. And if anything, he serves Please. as a backup plane in case anything happens during your flight. Okay? All right, so with no further ado, it's all yours, Mrs. Lynn. Let's figure out how to take off here. Okay. Now, now Miss Lynn, Miss Lynn. Since you are flying, we need you to navigate us as far as where we're going and what we need to check. And if there are any sound effects that we do happen to hear from the plane, I'm sure we'll hear that from the back. Um, Ray, you have a good visual on that, right? Most likely you'll be providing any sound effects, letting us know anything happens there. All right, so Sydney, no further ado, you may begin. Okay, okay so we're, we're going to play. Now, what's the first thing you have to do on the ground right now, right? Yeah, and okay. we're about to take off. Okay, so... And we're going to France. Okay, so you have to make sure you do all your checks. Okay, the checks are on. What, what were the checks? Don't you usually sound them out so that Ray knows what you're doing? Because you got to teach him at the same time how to fly the plane in case something happens to you. Okay. Um, what, um, Ray says he did. Wow. 
Okay, well, good luck on this one. Safe travels. So they must be going around the runway right now. That's what it sounds like. Okay, we'll go, we go, we go, go. Oh, they're going up. Oh, wow. Oh, we're up, we're up. We're... Sounds more like a helicopter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it definitely sounds like a helicopter. Oh, my. Hey, hey, Lynn, how you doing up there? Yeah. We, we got a report that it's very windy up there, so really be careful. Okay. You might want okay. to get above the okay. wind. Okay, okay. Okay, we're going to stop. We're going to start moving. <laughs> okay. Um, the kids are fine, but she, um, the kids say they're a little bit, like, sick. Well, what are you going to do? What do you do when you have passengers that are sick? <laughs> no, no. Um... We're just going to let them have a little bit of air. Oh, is that safe? <laughs> yes. Is that safe to do in an airplane? How high up are you? <laughs> no, um, we're going to have to go now. Oh, wow. That might be a liability. But whatever whatever you think is best. <laughs> I know. <laughs> no, no, I don't think it's going to be safe. So uh, let's let's come to the side here. Yeah, let's here. They have two children um, sticking their heads out of a plane, and they look like they have smiles on their face. Oh, and there goes one, and there goes the other. I don't think you can pick them up after you put them out. They fall all the way down. Did they have parachutes? Yes. They did. Yeah, they all live it. Oh, you might want to keep that door closed. A little bit of a draft might come in. You can't go out of the plane, or else <laughs> you can't go out of the plane. Whoa, whoa, you know what, that windstorm's coming, that windstorm's coming. Uh-oh, uh-oh, there goes your wing. <laughs> yeah, there goes your wing. You must rely on Ethan's arms. Ethan's arms. Ethan's arms are the only thing that can save the day. Ethan, you're the makeshift plane. Go. Go. Ethan's arms are out. It doesn't look too good. Sydney, you had to execute an emergency landing, but you just jumped out of the plane. So now it's just, you can't jump out of the plane to put the wing back on. That's just not going to work. It's not going to work. All right, Sydney is flying through the air. Ethan is falling. I don't know what Sydney's doing right now. She's putting the plane back together. Uh, and she somehow magically gets back in the plane. This just doesn't seem like this would work this way. All right. Um, okay, I guess time for an emergency landing since you had to reattach okay, go. the oh, wing. No. Come on, kids! Kids! The kids are still there. I thought they flew out. We're landing. Oh, my. there goes the wing again. Oh, no. There goes oh, no. the wing again. Ethan has to be the makeshift. Uh, Ethan has to be the makeshift plane because right now you have no wings. Ethan, you have. I'm sorry, Ray of Sunshine. You have no wings. Ray of Sunshine is about to fall out of the back of the plane. He's flapping his wings. Lynn, are you steering the, the plane? Oh, no, are no. you close to the ground? Is no crash okay. landing? What? Stop! Oh no! We're going up again! No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, and that's the end of the uh, that's the end of the test flight. All right. Um, so it doesn't look like your plane stayed together. That wing falling off the definitely kids created some issues. Blood on them. All right. So. So after everyone exits what's left of the plane, we need to get a, a debriefing of what actually happened that was good and not so good on your flight. The kids are you have to go over there. Dead. The kids were almost dead. Okay. You didn't have to be in the airplane anymore. Okay, just stand next to each other. Okay, debriefing. Turn around, Miss Lynn. That was a great flight. Uh, wait, wait. I'm sorry. Say that again. That was a great flight. So no, wait, 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 we get to ask questions on the crash. So I'm, a, I'm a, So you crash landed. How did you survive I the incident? I went off the cloud and crashed. So you crashed in the ocean, and that was the reason for your survival? Yes, we were very close to California. So after we just rode for like five minutes on our boat, that we had Sydney, to before you go away. Your kids flew out of the plane. How did you not only jump out of the plane to save them, 
but uh, reattach uh, the wing and get back in. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, you use glue. Oh, that was ingenious. I always have glue in my back pocket. <laughs> okay. That's wonderful. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'm so sorry, Ray. Ray, how did you feel when the wing actually fell off and you had to put your, your arms through the plane to keep it uh, off the ground? I felt like I was flying my dreams. So, did, you, did your dreams come to life with this test flight? They came to life in my body. But, um... So yeah, they were great. The wing was gonna, not going to fall off. Sorry, um, it was about to fall off. But somebody, sorry, somebody um, tried to take off the manual heavyweights to balance the plane out. They out I tried and they didn't work anyway. So it's their fault. All right. And since you two were such a dynamite team, would you work together in the future for our first flight for Brower Airlines? Yes. It might be your last flight. Yes. Well, thank you so much for joining us. We love the engineering pieces you put together. You know, we I'm love you. You can put the plane back I'm together. I'm going to love myself. Uh, and you know what? We'll actually look forward to the next time when we actually have our first official flight and our flight manifest to bring you two on board. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Until next time. Bye.